yeah, go for it, go for it. I'm trying to get back into vlogging and videos. Um, so this is gonna be my first attempt at it. Y'all, I swear, after I had my baby, like, words do not come as fast as, as they usually or typically do. I find myself stuttering a lot and thinking about, I don't know, it's just, it's just the weirdest thing, I swear. Like, my baby is gonna be a genius because she has taken my brain. But anyways, but it's crazy thing is like um, at court, you know, when I'm doing my arguments or whatever in trial, I'm pretty well, I'm pretty good on my feet. But just to like have typical or normal conversations, it's like so hard sometimes for me to find the right word. It comes, but I'm not as sharp. I need some something. To, I need to take something because this is ridiculous. Anyway, so bear with me. So I am going to put on a little bit of makeup today. Um, I went to Miami. Um, Cause I had a, I went on a cruise with my girlfriend. Um, she turned forty, so we went on a cruise. We were in Cuba and Bahamas. I didn't record any of it. I've been on a couple of really awesome trips um, in twenty eighteen, and um, I just you know I haven't posted pictures or um, done any videos. Um, just you know I was just kind of really enjoying my time with my friends and family. Um, so I went to Cuba and Bahamas. That was cool. Um, I went to Aspen with my family. I think I, I did post an Instagram picture of that. Um, I went to, and I went to Denver, Colorado, with my best friend and my sister. That was really cool as well. Um, did a lot of trips to DC, came from Texas. Um, this year, I'm thinking if not this year, next year, I'm gonna go back international and do an international trip with my family though. <clears throat> so, you know, typically <laughs> the years prior, I didn't have a family, so it was easy for me to jump up and go. But now with the baby, okay, I see you, I see you. Now with the baby um, and a husband, you know, that could be, it's different, of course. I don't think it's challenging, but it's different. So um, I'm thinking, I don't know if it's going to be this year, next year. Our, our birthdays, my daughter was born in April, my husband in May, and I'm in June. So we're like, literally like, almost, you know, month apart, months apart. Um, so I don't know if I'm going to do an international trip this year or next year. I do want to go to Haiti. Um, I'm not, I don't know when that is going to be, but I want to go with my, my, my parents first. Um, so I want to go to Haiti and I think I want to go to Italy. I've only been to Amsterdam and that was as a layover going to Kenya, but I spent like 24 hours in Amsterdam. So I count it as I've been to Amsterdam. Um, so this year I'm planning some trips. Um, with my family and friends, and I'm trying to put, trying to get more organized. Hey, girl. Oh, good. Good job. Yeah, I see you. I see you. I'm trying to get more organized and plan for my trips like ahead of the year instead of, I'm very, sometimes I'm very spontaneous, you know? Um, so my husband's gig, he flies all of the time. So I'm here because I'm in Atlanta because of him. Next, next week, I think he's going to Sundance and then the following week we go to Miami. So in January, he would have only spent um, one weekend in at home, which is Chicago. Oh, he travels a lot. I will try to accompany him on um, some of those trips. I'm not going to go to Sundance next week um, just because, I don't know, I need to, I just moved from a certain division at work to a new one and I need to like hunker down. Um, I have some trials coming up in which, um, you know, these are new clients. And so I need to really kind of focus on that. So I won't be traveling this weekend. But Miami, I will be going to Miami. Um, and my baby will go with me. So last time I was in Miami, it was just me, me by myself. And my husband had my daughter for like six whole days, a week actually, which was, I was missing her like crazy. Um, but it was good to be away and kind of, you know, able to just, you know, do you uh, anyway so what am i doing i'm gonna get ready i am dressed i have on my 
Nikes. I have on this thrifted sweater that I love so much. Um, and it's actually been washed and washing over the years. Kind of got it smaller and smaller and smaller. I don't know where to go, but I may have too soon. I have my black rider pants um, from American Apparel. I'm going to do my makeup, which is really uh, simple, 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 simple. Because considering I am just going to the aquarium with this girl, let me check to see if she's. What are you doing? I want to make sure she wants. Sure when I wear sweaters, I typically try to put my hair up because lint and stuff. I had to get rid of a couple sweaters because the lint that it caused on my hair was ridiculous. Certain sweaters don't shed, but often um, most of them do. I got my hair done um, when I went back home. Yeah, it was like a last week of November. I went back home and I'm gonna get it redone. Um, so I'm gonna take out the twist and have it curly for about two weeks once I go back to work um, on Monday. I think I'll do it like on Tuesday or some Monday. Monday after work or Tuesday morning. Um, and my edges from <laughs> birth, I said birth, yeah, from giving birth, you know, postpartum shedding there, they've, they've grown in great. Um, there's a little, still a little bit of sparseness here, um, but thank you, Jesus. I got, I got some edges, so I'm grateful about that. So also my skin. Um, I reckon I realized that my skin was getting so dry and I think it's because one I think my skin has definitely changed um, after giving birth um, I've never had acne and I still don't have acne um, but I developed a lot of moles all over my face which I don't mind I think they're pretty cute um, I have them all over my body it was just like crazy my mom has moles and I wonder if she got them after um, pregnancy as well um, so I just have just a lot of moles on my face and my body. And I was noticing that um, my face was, I don't know, it was just really dry. So I was like, maybe it's not water, maybe it's water consumption. And then I was like, you know what? Let me go, let me go back to Cetaphil. Cause Cetaphil is pretty good um, for like moisture issues and you know, dry skin. So that's what I am now using on my skin in terms of soap. Um, I use it on my face, and um, I also use the lotion to moisturize. So it has caused um, me to feel better about my skin. And the girl is um, shredding um, 12 paper. Anyway, so this is some cheap foundation, y'all. I do want to transition to green beauty. However, I, I need to use all my foundation. I don't care if they cost $2. I want to use them all up. Um, so, I haven't bought any foundation. I'm trying to wait until I finish this. This is actually, I put it in this little test tube and I actually mixed it with this NYX um, bronzer and a BB cream from somewhere, I don't know. So, I'm just gonna put just a little bit of this on my face. And also, it, it was a while, I wanna stand up actually, but it's been, um, I don't know if you all remember if I told you this, but I did not um, arch my eyebrows for a minute. Y'all want to see my, let me just do my face. I didn't arch my eyebrows for a minute because I wanted it to grow in a bit thicker. Like when I was a virgin to arching or shipping my brows, that's what I wanted to return to. And my brows were like, oh hell no. And I did not get the fullness that I thought I would get. So, it is what it is. So I was like, okay. I got it threaded. Um, I got it threaded. Wait, oh, I guess yeah, I got it threaded when I went to Miami um, for my um, friend's 40th birthday trip. I got it threaded then, and I don't think I'm ever gonna thread again. It's just my eyebrows feel like weird. Like it feels like I have like scars in my brow. I'm just gonna um, pencil it in. Ah. Hey, mama. I'm just gonna pencil it in. Ah. Okay, hi. She says hi, y'all. Ashley, thank you. Oh, you put some makeup on? You got beautiful skin. 
Okay, so. So we're done. I just need to put on some gloss lipstick something for my lips. Oh, I'm so scared. And we are done. Leave it open, please. Cause I need some air. Move your fingers. Move your hand. Thank you. No, it's okay. It's okay. Yes, ma'am. So that's it, y'all. This is the look. All right, just very simple. Just going to the aquarium. Um, I'm wearing these little bar earrings. I got them from Target or something like that. Um, Nameplate. It says Jean-Bierre, my daughter's name. And that's that. So we're going to the aquarium. <laughs>